Hello, welcome to English Idioms and Slang. For our first episode in this series, we're just going to talk about what idioms and slang actually are. They both have a similar meaning. They both mean that you are using words in ways that a dictionary would not say that that's what the definition of the word is. For example, if you say the Avengers Endgame movie was really cool, you mean it was awesome or great. But the word cool in English actually means a little bit cold. So that is a slang word for awesome or great. So now what's the difference between an idiom and slang? Idioms, everyone knows them. They can be informal or formal, and they're usually phrases. Not always, but usually. For example, don't bite the hand that feeds you. It means don't be mean to someone who is being nice to you. Slang is not necessarily known to everyone. It's usually informal, and it usually has just one or two words. The example I give here is the word gnarly. That was popular in the 1980s, like the word cool. It's also slang for awesome, but it's very informal, and at least when it started, it was only used in a certain segment of American culture. It did spread after that, but at first it was only in America. Now, sometimes it's not obvious if something is an idiom or slang. For example, cool. Everyone knows it, but it's informal. So how do we decide? Well, those are two of the three criteria. We use the third one as the tiebreaker. It's one word, so it is slang. And here's another example. I'll show you this video of a commercial from the 1980s, which is another questionable one. Is it idiom or is it slang? So here's this commercial. This is a big one. It's a very big one. Big fluffy one. It's a very big fluffy one. Where's the beef? Stop hamburger place to give you a lot less beef on a lot of bun. Where's the beef? At Wendy's, we serve a hamburger we modestly call a single. At Wendy's, single has more beef than the Whopper or Big Mac. At Wendy's, you get more beef and less bun. Hey, where's the beef? I don't think you get my factor. You want something better. You're Wendy's kind of people. Okay, so in this commercial that's not really being used as an idiom or slang, she really means where is the beef? But what this came to mean in American culture is that something important is missing. So is this an idiom or slang? It's a phrase, not just one word, so that fits into idiom. It's quite informal, so that's slang. So which one is it? Well, it's also very well known, so it's an idiom. So again, you're going to look for two out of three things to fit in order to call something an idiom or slang. Okay, so now when we go forward with this series, you'll see that episode two, we're going to talk about slang in greetings. I hope you'll join me for that episode, and I will see you soon.